here we're going to use Windows Power Toys. You're going to use the Fancy Zones uh, part of the program here. Uh, we're going to enable Fancy Zones. We're going to uh, launch our layout editor. You're going to click on a custom layout, click the edit button. In the middle, there is a button to change the actual layout. Uh, we don't need to lay worry about layout shortcut here, but click the middle button uh, to edit the zones. I have six zones set up right now. You click the plus button to add more zones. You click on each zone and resize it and move around as you like. And these are what I found works for me. Uh, so I'm going to save that uh, there. I'll show you a couple of the other zones where I like it. I like my choir tab on the bottom left, uh, CBCT in five and six, and then the uh, organizer in two. Uh, I'm going to scroll down to the bottom here because I need to be able to hit the Windows key left and right to move them around the zones. And that's not the one I want. I want the next one. I'm going to go to override Windows Snap on, and then I'm going to click it by zone index. So it's just going to cycle. It's going to pop them around one, two, three, four, five, six, and then start back at the end again um, as I hit left and right. So as I open them up, as I hit the Windows key left and right, it's going to cycle them around the zones. Really easy to uh, set up these windows uh, uh, quickly rather than moving and dragging and trying to do that from across the room. This is much easier. Uh, for some reason, it doesn't work with the calendar. The Windows calendar is just a different type of window, I guess, and it also does not work with the draw page. So both of those are just uh, encoded differently, I guess, in TDO.